the bar I'm disappointed. I'm disappointed because the same attorneys who are pushing the Attorney General, um, who is pushing for this change, and the Prime Minister himself, they are senior members of the bar. They were there from eons now since the bar has been in existence. And the statements they have made publicly is their confession of saying to us, the younger attorneys before the bar, that they failed us. Because the bar is where it is right now, not because of us who just joined, but, but because of them who have been in it all along. Now they're trying to seek to solve the problem, they say, but I'm sorry, I think it's more of a problem they're creating. I don't think that dismantling the bar the, the way they're doing is the best thing. I have been a member before the bar now eight years, and I see a lot of problems with the bar. I have been one of those few attorneys who have written to the bar many times of the changes I would want to see, but it's not the changes I'm seeing that legislation is bringing about. I can name at least two major changes I would have wanted to see, and one of them is that we no longer self-police ourselves. I have a problem when there's a complaint against an attorney. It's the same set of attorneys who then hear the matter. I don't think that that's fair. I've always been one that I wanted to be like it's done in Jamaica where the attorney is taken to a weekend court, a Saturday court, and brought before a judge and there and then they make the decision. Under the system we have, the complaint is made to the General Legal Counsel who then doesn't issue a sanction, recommends one to the Chief Justice and the Chief Justice decides if it will be granted, that sanction will be implemented or not. I have a problem with that. I think it should be clear cut. Uh, an attorney who does wrong to anyone else should be dealt with just like any common criminal. We're not above the law. As a matter of fact, we should be held at a higher standard. That recommendation that is being passed right now by this government does not solve the problem. They've created another problem. And the truth be told, the present sitting attorney general has several complaints before the bar. I think he should not have allowed himself to be brought into that free. He should not have been the one dismantling the bar. He should have made the process work. That is my opinion. It doesn't look well for the highest level attorney in this country. And remember, he is the titular head of the bar. So any complaint he makes of the bar falls right in his laps.